Hello fellow YouTubers, Leo WC Stop Motioner here, and here I've got some really cool reveals. We got for Kingdom Wave 3 tomorrow, we got the Fan First Friday or something, and we're finally going to be seeing Kingdom Wave 3. I've been waiting, we haven't gotten any new Kingdom reveals in a while, you know, like a whole, just the whole wave. I'm looking forward to this. So we have three figures, one of them I've already talked about, and yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So the ones we got are Galvatron, The Ark, and Scorponog. So first up is Scorponog. This is what I was looking forward to. Well, Scorponog was not necessarily a super prominent or amazing character in Beast Wars. He, the original version is very expensive. And I don't really feel so inclined to spend so much on, you know, a kind of myth character. And this one does have the little drone i hope that can detach unfortunately it looks like the wings are kind of stuck in place but oh well he looks pretty good in beast mode though i like the look of him I and mean, maybe his eyes could be a little bit better but you know at least in terms of show accuracy but otherwise i really don't have a whole lot to complain about i'm pretty happy with it robot mode is pretty good the legs look a little stubby to me but maybe that's how they were in the show. I don't fully remember, but his proportions just look a little off to me. Overall, though, I, I still think he looks great. Yes, he does look like he's going to kind of have a backpack, but oh well. Could be worse. So I really like the look of him, and he's a deluxe, so I'm very happy about that. Now we got Galvatron. And I am bothered by the treads hanging off his arms. It should really conceal a little bit better. But otherwise, I think he looks really good. He's got the Matrix on a chain hanging around his neck. Can attach that to him in cannon mode. So that's really cool. He's got the two guns that, you know, look like the ship he flew in. And overall, I'm pretty happy with him. And he's a leader, so that's really good. He's going to be 50. He, hopefully height-wise, will be worth the 50. I hope so, at least by today's standards. But now we got Titan Arc. And I'm not going to lie, I was initially not really on board for there being an ARC figure. And I figured, like, oh, it's going to be too expensive. But, yes, this is going to be expensive, but it looks stinking awesome. I might be reconsidering getting this. Just look at it. The ARC crash there looks really cool. And, but it, it comes with Teletran 1, and it has the little drone. Teletrain 1 tur is, turns into a robot. I mean, that is just sick. That is amazing. I love that. The, got the, the ramp that comes out of him. The arc mode looks good. His robot mode is amazing. And, yeah, these reveals are just really cool. I'm looking forward to the reveals we're going to be getting tomorrow. We're supposed to be getting Rhinox. I'm, I'm so excited about getting Rhinox. I have... I've just really been awaiting his reveal. This is going to be really awesome. My poor wallet, but still, it's going to be awesome. I might still have to wait a little bit before I pre-order Rhinox and Scorponok, but hopefully I can get them. But yeah, that's what we got for Kingdom Wave 3 so far. Like I said, these are awesome reveals. I'm just really loving Kingdom right now. <laughs> this is so cool. So that's the reveals we got for today. I'll probably have some reveals go over this weekend after Friday. And yeah. So, like this video, please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And God bless.